I think to start off, uh, you know, since uh, Praveen had an off day, you know, with the bowling, uh, it was very important that somebody, you know, uh, take up that extra responsibility. I think Ashwin did that. You know, first three he bowled in the first power play. Uh, the next time he bowled was the second power play, and the rest he bowled in the slog. So, uh, very impressive bowling. Uh, and I think he took it as a challenge and bowled in the right areas and contributed with the bat also. You know, it was very important. Uh, so overall, very happy with his performance. <laughs> Uh, I'm happy with the win and as I said, you know, uh, there were a few shots uh, that we shouldn't have played uh, but mistakes do happen in the game and it's good that we are on the winning side. We could have uh, lost this game also but it's good that we have won this game and, you know, once uh, something like this happens, you know, uh, you know, as a cricketer you feel bad as to if you play a bad shot. So it, it gives you a chance to come back in the sense, you know, uh, at the end of the day you have won the game. So I think most of the guys uh, will do that and hopefully we won't repeat the mistake in the coming games. Mike, uh, what is the status uh, with the large injuries? I just got cramps. So as of now, that's what it is. So I don't think it's very serious. You, restri you, you restricted yourself to only five front line bowlers. No experiment with Ben Ahad and well, it was working uh, because, uh, you know, Perth uh, usually it was one end, you know, that was uh, turning a bit more. The second end was quite flat, you know, from which uh, Jadeja was bowling. So I thought, you know, if uh, I go with a part timer, it may be slightly easy to uh, score for the opponent. So I, I thought, you know, if, if the field, if we can spread the field and let Praveen bowl, you know, he can get bet, uh, a bit of swing and, and, you know, maintain the kind of pressure that was there at that point of time. So that was the main reason why I didn't go to the part-timers because I thought, you know, maybe it will become a bit easier for the opposition to score. My 181 for seven. Well, it was, you know, uh, once I got out and after that, you know, Virat got run out, you know, we were at a stage, you know, where the game could have gone either way. Uh, it looked more as if it will go the Sri Lankan way uh, because, you know, they have somebody like a Malinga, you know, and uh, the last recognized player, you can say, was Ashwin and, and Jadeja. And, you know, with the kind of slingy action that he has got, you know, you can misread one ball and you can get out. So it was very important that uh, they get some kind of a partnership going, not with the amount of runs, but more with the number of balls that they face so that they get used to the light and the bowling action of the different kinds of bowlers. So I think they did well to that, you know, they didn't play any big shots, uh, but of course, you know, running was good and, you know, they just placed it in the right area and, you know, went for the single. Uh, from our side? Our intensity going down, so not, not here. going. Yeah. 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 Uh, from our side. No, maybe it's because you know there were not 280 runs on the board, and you know it didn't go close enough. At times you do feel uh, like that, but I don't think that was the case. You know we had our own problems to deal with you know as I said you know the very first over that Praveen bowled you know he was a bit off target so all of a sudden you have you know nine overs that you need to need someone to bowl but it was good that he came back and you know bowled a very good line and then didn't experiment too much so you know overall we are quite busy with the game and you know it's good that we are on the winning side so I don't think intensity at any uh, point of time was lower the game was not intense. Yes, please. Like, uh, Miru said yesterday that uh, you're looking at a rotation uh, policy for the three openers. Will that continue in Adelaide or uh, would you consider playing all three openers? No, I look to uh, rotate because, uh, as I said, I want Roy to play as many games as possible. So it gives him an opportunity to get set into the side also. So we'll see. Uh, hopefully, you know, the way we, uh, we are going as of now, we'll still look to rotate the openers. Uh, MS, you guys haven't won an away ODI. Uh, since North Sound in, in the West Indies. Do, do these statistics even matter in the dressing room? I mean, before you Well, I had no clue about the stats since you told me because, uh, you know, we play so much cricket that I even uh, had no clue when it was the last time we played abroad. Of course, England we knew, but, you know, before England, when was the last uh, game that we played? So it becomes a bit difficult to keep a track. But as, I, as you say, you know, uh, statistics you can prove most of the things that you want to prove so it's good that we have won a game you know outside India after a long time and it has come the hard way you know if it doesn't go your way 
you know things are pretty difficult to come so that was also a reason you know why the game went so close